filing taxes in Canada. Tax season starts early, with forms and publications available to view by January. In 2022, the tax filing deadline is the end of April. There are many ways to file your taxes in Canada, including File online The CRA has an online setup that allows individuals to send their returns via NetFile. Tax filing software such as TurboTax, SimpleTax, or other equivalent platforms will help you prepare your returns following the CRA prompts. A certified tax preparation company is ideal for maximizing tax savings and filing convenience. Mail in a paper copy You can view and download tax forms on the CRA website. Fill them out and mail your returns to complete the process. Tax accountants can also help you with tax advice and organization if you're struggling. File by phone Individuals with low, fixed, or stable incomes may be invited to file using the CRA automated phone service. Your tax resources Tax season doesn't need to be stressful and rushed. We've developed this guide to help you navigate your taxes with ease. Here are all the answers to your tax-related questions. What is the average tax refund in Canada? Canada has differing tax brackets with varying rates which help individuals determine how much they can expect back. For example, if you earn between $27,069 and $150,473, you'll be taxed at a rate of 26%. According to the CRA, the average refund amount for 2021 was $1,573. However, remember that factors like employer withholding, deductions, self-employment, and more are likely to affect your refund amount. Do students pay income tax? Some students are exempt from paying tax if they fall under the full-time student status. The CR qualifies such an individual as one who regularly attends an educational institution at the post-secondary level. In addition, the student must be enrolled in a qualifying educational program with at least 10 hours of instruction a week. However, those who are enrolled part-time but eligible for the Disability Tax Credit DTC could still qualify. Students will need to pay income tax if they receive income while working at school irrespective of status. This includes part-time work and working for yourself. How being married affects your tax rate. The CRA has rules in place that apply to common law or married spouses. You will not need to file your income tax returns jointly but individuals will need to indicate their marital status and report the details of their spouse. However, filing as a couple will maximize tax benefits and claims such as G, ST slash H, ST or CCB. Failure to disclose marital status can be considered tax fraud and render you liable to penalty and interest. Filing taxes after a separation. The first step after separation is to notify the CR of your new marital status. You will need to wait a minimum of 90 days before making a claim. Prove the change through documentation such as car insurance, household bills, or mortgage papers. In addition, the CR will recognize your separation only if you are living officially in separate households. The amount of taxes you owe will then depend on your household income. You may be eligible for CCB, G, ST or HST, and other refundable tax credits as well. How Charitable Tax Credit Works Donations are tax-deductible in Canada. No matter the amount you donate, you are likely to get some of it back as a tax credit. You may qualify for the Charitable Donation Tax Credit CDTC if you've donated to a qualifying donee. A qualifying donee is defined as a registered charity or public organization. Keep a receipt of your donation to claim the CDTC Remember, anyone qualifies for this tax credit, so if you're donating, be sure to make your claims. The Best Tax Return Software Having all of the different types of taxes explained above is one thing, knowing how to file them is a separate story altogether. For that reason Insurdinary has put together a comprehensive video on the best tax return software. There are so many to choose from and you'd be surprised at how simple they are to use. Many are free, and some are paid for extra features, but all offer easy-to-understand walkthroughs on the often mundane task of tax filing. Get started on your taxes today. In conclusion, don't forget to research some of the best tax return software for Canadians. With taxes, education is key. Arm yourself with the knowledge on how to go about filing and managing your taxes, and you'll be golden. If you need more help with your taxes, be sure to check out the Insurdinary Tax Series for valuable insights.